So here are three different takes on the same basic idea, which is the rubber band shock mount for the camera. The idea is to take two doubled up rubber bands and attach a single one between them, and then attach that out of a bottle and hook it onto the side, like this. So here there's a loop of string tied to the rubber band, letting it pulling down to the harness. Now, on a soda bottle, the neck is narrow enough so that you can pull from a single point off the side and not be too far off of vertical, which is right in the middle of the bottle. In a juice bottle, that's not possible because the neck is much wider. So in a juice bottle, you use two rubber bands to attach the harness. In heavier cameras, we do a different type of knot where we tie the attachment points directly to the knot and to these doubled up rubber bands to give it extra strength. So uh, let's get started and I'll show you how to tie up your harness out of five rubber bands and a piece of string. So here's the harness step by step. Number one, tie a doubled up rubber band to a single rubber band. Tie two doubled up rubber bands. Then tie the middle piece, make a loop, then attach it all into a harness and then it can be loaded into a soda bottle rig. So let's get started. We've got five rubber bands. So what I'm going to do first is double up a rubber band. So I fold it in half, fold it in over one finger, tuck my other finger into it, and then pull one rubber band through, and then tuck it through itself and pull tight. Next, I'm going to do the same on the other side. I'm going to double up a rubber band, open it up between two fingers, tuck my other piece through, and then through itself by pulling the doubled up rubber band through the single rubber band I just tucked through this side. see where I'm going. Step two, I tie one piece off to the middle by tucking a rubber band through itself and then pulling these two doubled up rubber bands together so I know I have the exact middle and pulling tight. Next I need to tie a loop. The loop is just an overhand knot tied to a doubled up piece of string. So I'm going to double the string up, fold it in half, then I'm going to take this loop end, fold it across, and tuck it through so I have a knot like that. Then I'm going to pull it tight by pushing it towards away from the loop end. So I'll push it away from the loop end and pull it tight and I have a loop. So now I'm going to tie the loop to my harness. These tassels can get in the way of the camera if I'm not careful. So I'm going to tie them by tucking the loop through the tassel end and pulling tight like that. I'm done.